Hello everyone. Hello. My name is Yuta Katamoto. Today I would like to talk about studying abroad to the United States. Uh, how much do you have about the studying abroad? Uh, I think uh, some people have good image, but others uh, have a bad image. I want you to listen to my opinion, uh, which is the image about studying abroad to the United States. This is Slay's outline. First, I, I, want, I will talk about the reason why I would like to talk about studying, about studying abroad to the United States and the purpose of this presentation and the country which the people who study abroad go. And second, uh, there are a lot of places in the United States, so I will talk about what kind of races in the United States. And third, uh, I will talk about what you can get uh, only in the United States. And fourth, I'll discuss this presentation's conclusion. And last, I will show you references. OK, now let's start my presentation. Uh, the reason why I did some, I, I would like to talk about uh, sending abroad to the United States is that uh, I want I want to study abroad to the United States and work all over the world and I want a lot of people to study abroad to the United States and work all over the world. So the purpose of this presentation is that I insist that uh, there are a lot of country which whose people speak English, uh, but I but the people who would like to study abroad should go to the United States uh, from the from one point. The point is that uh, there are the largest races in the United States. Um, the, Recently, uh, the number of the people who study abroad is increasing. Um, the United States is the most popular uh, country which the people who study abroad go. Uh, the, uh, the United States is not only the most popular country, but also uh, the the United States has the uh, largest races in the uh, largest races. For example, German, England, Irish, African, mixed blood, Mexican, Italian, American, uh, and so on live in the United States. Uh, what what do you think uh, you can get in, uh, if you study abroad to the United States. I, I explain it. Uh, there are a lot of, uh, there are the largest places in the United States, so you can meet uh, a lot of people who, who have a various sense of value. Uh, and you can know out of various ideas, and, and therefore, you can broaden your horizon. Uh, if, it, if you go to the United States, uh, you can you can find you can learn a lot of sense of uh, a lot of various sense of value. Uh, if you go to other as a country, uh, you you can run some some sense of value, but they are fewer than that you can you can get in the United States. So so if you study abroad to the United States, or you can broaden your horizon. Uh, if you have a chance, let's go to the USA. <laughs> this is references. Thank you for listening to my speech.